Well, they may put out fires for a living, but these heroes are burning up the new FDNY calendar. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Here to talk about their sizzling pictures are New York City's firefighters, Denea Mines, Dylan Morgan, and Joe Conforti. Welcome to the show. Yes. Thank you. Yes. Lola is very excited, if you can tell. <laughs> I'm gonna have to put her fire out. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> So clearly you all know how to put out a fire, but did you know how to model? And how did you become a part of this calendar? Who's that told? Just... <laughs> <laughs> Who wants Take to answer away. first? Um, no, I mean, I, it came pretty naturally. I don't know, I don't know why. Uh-huh. But uh, in front of the camera, I wasn't nervous. I'm more nervous in front of these cameras than I am in, uh, in that studio. Oh, stop. Uh, don't be nervous. <laughs> <laughs> we'll take care of you. <laughs> so, so how was the audition process, and how many other firefighters did you have to go up against? It was, it was pretty competitive. You just mm -hmm. showed up. It was a lot of guys, girls showed up, and mm -hmm. uh, they took pictures and made the best woman or man win. Okay. Now, Danae, you're one of the few women that's ever mm -hmm. been featured in one of these calendars. What made you want to be a part of this? It's just something I always wanted to do because it's for a good cause. Mm -hmm. And I also wanted to show representation for the women in the department. Mm -hmm. Now, you're pretty covered up in the calendar, but men, <laughs> you are not <laughs> at all. What was it like for you all to bear all? And I, mean, I do it, mean all. We worked, we worked yeah, hard, yeah. so it was actually... <laughs> We were, we were itching to take our shirts off. <laughs> I was like, well, you get back there doing push-ups right before the show? Yep, get, yeah, get a puff on, absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> you look the best. Well, wait, you're actually the first female that has ever been in this calendar, and you're less than 1% women on the fire in the New York City Fire Department. So what advice yes. do you give to other women who we hope will look at your picture and say, I want to join the fire department? If you want it, do it. Mm -hmm. yeah. That's good. That's good advice. You want to do it. <laughs> so how do you prepare for something like this? Do you mm -hmm. go on a no-carb diet? Do you work out, push-ups? Are you? What, uh, what do you do? Are you yeah. climbing up and down the pole every few hours <laughs> to make sure you have upper body strength? Are you pretty good workout? Yeah. Uh, a lot, a lot of, of calisthenics. calisthenics. Mm -hmm. A lot of yeah. calisthenics, and you just got to stay disciplined. Uh, it's, it's bigger than just the calendar. It, the proceeds it goes to a great, great foundation, and just being in shape for the fire department—that's that's where you need to be anyway. Mm -hmm. well, where do the proceeds go, and how much is typically raised? The fire Foundation—they—they they, they raise a tremendous amount. I don't have exact numbers, mm -hmm. but they—they're they, able to fund the fire, the fire, fire zone, mm -hmm. the fire department, high school. They, they along with the O'Leary project, they gave us our high-rise simulator that people come to train from oh, all across okay. the world. So they—they they spend a lot. A lot of the proceeds go to, I believe, somewhere. Above 90% is spent, everything they collect just goes right back into the functioning folk, smoke detectors, COs. So they do a lot for us, so this was the little we could give back. Now, and what do your safety. friends and family make of you all <laughs> posing in these calendars? <laughs> they must get a chuckle out of it, oh, or some man. of them must be just so My thrilled. mother's loving it. I must yeah. have gave her 20 calendars already. She's, <laughs> she's handing them out of work. <laughs> she's like, that's my boy. Yeah, that's my boy. Yeah. <laughs> Those are his blue eyes. So, uh -huh. so I did was going, I, I only did see, pick, take pictures shirtless. And <laughs> so you guys like celebrities, when you arrive to a fire, do they recognize you? Like, hey, we know you have your calendar. No. <laughs> Not at all. No. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's probably the last thing they're, they're thinking about. Right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, save oh, me. Right, right. Save my cat. <laughs> <laughs> what made each of you all want to become firefighters? I'm, I'm interested. Do you want to start? Um, a firefighter came to my school in elementary mm -hmm. and told us at the end of his presentation that all of us could be firefighters. And from that moment on, I wanted to become a firefighter. Mm -hmm. Really? Mm -hmm. What about you? And I just saw... Uh, just thought about it, I was filling out an application, wanted to do something with my life, and I, as I like filled this application out, and I told people, I, I, did, I, got a, I didn't get the reviews I was hoping for, I got a lot of people saying negative things about the fire department, which was like, oh, you know, you being black, it's, it's not possible, and, mm -hmm. and it wasn't from anybody that was on the fire department, so I pursued mm -hmm. it just for that, I kept it to myself, and I'm um, proof that if you want something, and it's a great job, it's mm -hmm. there for you. Mm. And Joe? Uh, my best friend's father was a fireman. Oh. So he would take us to the Christmas parties, the picnics, and I saw the camaraderie in the firehouse. Mm -hmm. All the guys were close. They always joked around with each other. Even the families were close. Mm. So I knew it was something that I wanted from, I don't know, early age, like wow. eight, nine oh, years really? old. Well, we can't let you go without giving us some fire safety tips. A lot of people are out there watching. What do they need to know about keeping their house, their family safe? Definitely smoke detector. Uh, yes, Number change the batteries twice And we just set the clocks back, so it's a perfect Absolutely. time to start checking right. those batteries, yep. right? We tell them exactly. to change it every six months right okay. when you change your clock back. So. Mm -hmm. okay. You can't stress it enough, smoke detectors in the house. There's been so many detector. fatal fires where if they had a smoke detector, they would have made it out. Wow. You know, so. Oh, right. 
Definitely have those smoke detectors working. I All have right. a quick question. Just mm -hmm. stop dropping and rolling really work. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm serious. Yeah, try it, Lola. Yes. <laughs> if you're on fire, yes. If you're on fire, yes. Because it, it suffocates the fire, is that what it is? Smuggling, Running smuggling while you're on fire definitely won't help. So, <laughs> so, so don't, don't run. Don't, don't, don't run. run. <laughs> don't run. But stop, drop, and roll. Stop, stop drop, and roll. roll. Yeah. Okay, so they were right in elementary school. It does yes, work. Absolutely. All right. Yeah. Well, good to know. Okay, real quick, where can we get the calendar? FT1. Good. FDMI Foundation. You can say it all together. One, two, three. FDMI Foundation.org. Nice. All right. Good job. We'll put it on our website, too. Thank you guys so much for joining us, and keep up the great work keeping us safe. Thank you. Thank you for having us. Getting hot in here. Whoa. So we better take it to commercial. We'll be right back. Yeah, you're watching Horizon Entertainment 360. Yeah.